Yo, 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 what's up, beautiful soul? So it's a beautiful day. All right. So I basically wanted to um, do a journal. I went to GNC um, and immediately, immediately, I spirit told me that this young lady was, her grandfather came in for her and her grandfather wanted to let her know that he was proud of her poise and how she was going about her obstacles. And she was like, so I don't have any problems. I was like, you know, a lot of times spirit don't come to you per se because there's a problem. They want to come to you because you're handling your, your problems with a sense of poise. You understand what I'm saying? And, um, and she was like, I was like, but there are problems. You know what I'm saying? You're going through a multitude of situations. You're going through being distant from a lot of people you're going through a multitude of things that spirit was telling me that i that i i let her know but that wasn't the why spirit came in spirit came in because they her ancestors were proud of her that she was handling it with such poise and basically she's going to get through it because they're going to you know be by her you know while she's defeating these obstacles and demons um, and you guys, guys have got to know that if enough people put negative on your name or on your character, you've got to believe and understand that this causes a cloud over you that causes. So you've got to take your cleansing baths, prayer, pray to your ancestors and spirit guides and um, to pray to God for protection. Because there's people out here who do that do not want to see you win. That can intimidate your soul with bad energy and stuff like that so it's important to stay prayed up and make sure your karma is beautiful because as long as your karma is beautiful can no bad energy or anything project the utmost highlight god anything that's directed at you goes right back to them 10 times full so it's important to keep your karma beautiful stay prayed up love yourself you know what i'm saying and love them for they know not what they do you know what I'm saying? Um, she was a um, a victim of hatred, jealousy, being a strong um, woman. You, sh you, these are usually the target of jealousy, envy, and things like that. And instead of being able to handle it with handle it, it um, it, it creates a cloud that makes us not who we usually are, so to speak. So you could be this good person. But you could be like misunderstood or people could be hating on you because you're a leader. You're a boss. You're the manager. You know what I'm saying? So people don't want to see you win. But then it their emotions project on you. And then you're acting like passive aggressive and disrespectful. But it's unintended. Because you can't even bask in the glory of your success. Because people directing this bad negative energy on you. Keeping you from... You're successful, but you're not accelerating spiritually because you're receiving all this bad energy and mojo. You know what I'm saying? You got to cleanse yourself daily. Burn your sage. Say your prayers. Love on yourself. It's a must. And any codependence of people that you know in your life that really don't want to see you win, let them go. Let them go and pray for them from a distance. Okay? Because that's the main test in this school called Earth. Codependencies. Senseless codependencies that cause tower effects in your life. And dealing with these karmics. Karmics are people that are were just put there to teach you a lesson on how to be a better you. And if you don't defeat these moments with these karmics, it can end your life. It can end, your, it can end anything. You know what I'm saying? And so st stand tall. In your glory, you sit on your throne and you be sexy, you be cute, and you handle yours. And but protect your spirit, because people don't want to see you at the top. They don't want to see you on your throne. So I had to break that to her. And her, but her ancestors is with her to see her win. So, so I baby, relax. You're doing what you're supposed to do. I send love and light to all you beautiful souls. Four, four, four. It just hit on the timer. I love y'all. Namaste, and you know what I'm saying? God is present. You feel me? Um, you don't have to know them to love them. You don't have to know them to wish them well. Namaste.